If you're looking to buy small to team coins, go check out the FIFA shop.co.uk. All the links are down below in that description box. And use discount code of GC5 to get your 10% discount on all of your ores, guys. They're cheap, reliable, and you get your coins within 60 seconds. I feel you taking What's up guys, Juice Hansi here and welcome to a brand new video. Today we've got something a little bit different as you can tell by that intro. I'm going to be showing you if Martin Odegaard, the new rounded youngster, uh, was an ultimate team. What type of player would he be like? And say I'm going to show you like an alternative for him. I asked on Twitter, honestly, personally, I've not seen him much um, based on this off videos, but a lot of people suggested they have watched him and uh, I'm showing you a player that could potentially be like him if he has ever added to this FIFA or next FIFA. So guys, if you know 1,000 foreign likes to this video, that would be absolutely awesome. If you nail that, it will show you that you enjoy it. And in the comments below, don't you think if Martin Odegaard will be a success at Real Madrid and finally if you're new to our channel click the subscribe button for daily FIFA content this video like I said is mainly about the uh, the kind of alternative for Odegaard and the rest of the team is just there in the background but Overall, the team's quite solid. I mean, I have used the, the actual player himself. I'm not going to give away as of yet because obviously I've re uh, revealed that in a second. But the back line consists of Julio Cesar in goal, who honestly, I would, not, I would not have him. I thought it was absolutely shocking. You can have any Brazilian goalkeeper, but uh, Julio Cesar, I was trying him and honestly was not impressed at all. But then we've got Fernandez, uh, Manuel Fernandez from a locomotive Moscow, I do believe, in the Russian league. He's a very nice all rounded uh, Redon record and he's got a nice banger on him as well. And then we've got Mauricio. He's actually only 70 rated, but he's got some real, real nice stats and obviously gets that perfect link with uh, Antonio Ferreira. Defence was consistent, uh, consistent of um, Miranda, got Antonio Ferreira, and we got a left back, of course. And uh, I think it's DeMarcos at right back. He's one of my favourite on the game. And finally, we've got Isco. You can have any Spanish centre midfielder if you do want uh, from the BBVA. Front two consists of Dongu. I'm not going to pronounce that last bit, but Dongu, he's actually known as being um, the next Samuel Eto in the Barca rank. So it'd be nice to see if he develops as well. And then we've got an inform Ruben Castro. Again, you can have any Spanish striker from the Liga Adelante. So uh, Odegaard at the moment will actually be taking part with uh, Real Madrid Castilla, which if, I do, if I'm correct, I think Zinedine Zidane is actually the uh, manager of them. If not, he's, uh, he's very close to them. And basically that, that's probably some of the best uh, tutoring you can get uh, with one of the best ever midfielders. So Odegaard, uh, the actual version of him I've gone with uh, Halilovic he's actually a little Barca guy that signed for Barcelona B and is a Croatian so stats wise that is what everyone was saying everyone was saying uh, um, Odegaard would be like Halilovic which honestly Again, I've not seen much of him to actually say whether that's true or not, but it seems like based on videos, he's like a little nippy little player with some very good dribbling and good passing. So these are some alternatives uh, like like for Odegaard. But basically, again, uh, I know he's not left mid, but that guy, I can't pronounce his name. Um, I think I think he used to play for United, actually. Uh, he, could, he could be like, like a little alternative for him. And then we've got Ryan Gould, who's also a very good youngster. But basically, um, Halilovic, he's an incredible player in this game and also in non rep He scores some absolute bangers. His first few clips are actually from my Wonder Kid hybrid uh, I'd done a few months ago on Halilovic. And honestly, He's so damn good in the ball, and again, he kind of looks like him. In, I imagine like he would in game as well. He's not got a licensed face or anything, but he's a little uh, short blonde kid. Uh, he's got some nice technique in him, guys. Basically, like I said, it's a bit of a different video, and uh, hopefully it goes on quite well uh, because uh, I don't know. I, I kind of wanted to do it because I wanted to see. I mean, we all want older guys to be added to Ultimate Team, but right now, being a 16 year old, it's very unlikely he'll actually be added in this one. He may be added to a head to head if we're lucky. I mean. Now that's confirmed, to be honest, but uh, it'd be nice to see Odegaard be able to ultimate team. But I think FIFA 16, he'll definitely be on there. And um, that's as long as, actually, that's as long as Real Madrid uh, Castilla are actually on the game, because I think they're third tier of uh, the Spanish uh, football right now. So um, I don't know if he will be, actually, unless they put in the Real Madrid badge, which obviously would make sense. As in the, in the next couple of years, I imagine Martin Odegaard will make a big name for himself at the Bernabeu. And uh, people people remember that name for a long, long time. I mean, as a 16-year-old, he's playing for Real Madrid. He's uh, done more than most professional footballers have done their whole career by actually playing for the Bernabeu side which is it's incredible stuff thinking just of his age and um he has pretty much every single European club after him. So if things, I'm not saying I don't want them to happen, but if things do not work out for him at Real Madrid, um, I think pretty much every European football club will be after him, guys. So like I said, if you enjoyed this video, uh, smash that like button. If you know 1,000 foreign likes, that would be absolutely awesome. If you're new to my channel, click that subscribe button and uh, also let me know in the comments below. Do you think Martin Odegaard will be a success, guys? So yeah, I'm going to leave you the final goal. Thank you for this video and I'll see you next time.